11 for Arkansas, 147 remaining. One timeout left. All of 12 to go for the first down. Sterner lost the football! Oh my goodness! He stumbled and fumbled! And Billy Rowland recovered! Tennessee players told me this after the game. He said, yeah, the reason he stumbled was that we drove the guard all the way into the backfield, and he stumbled over his own guy. That's what caused the stumble, and, and Sterner trying to catch himself puts the ball down, and that's what caused the fumble. In the rare occasion where the guy who forced the fumble, who made the great play, actually gets the glory and the joy of touching the football, Billy Ratliff jumps on the ball. Because remember, most plays, the guy who recovers the fumble, he's kind of in the right place at the right time. Billy Ratliff made that happen on a day when he had been getting absolutely destroyed. Interesting, coming, I mean, I'm standing on the sideline, we've just gone fourth and down and didn't make it, and it looked like it didn't look good. And T's coming off the field and kind of raising his jersey, and it looks like he's getting ready to unsnap his pads. And Billy Ratliff says, T, Get your pads back on. We're getting ready to get the ball back to you. And I'm just it's just like unbelievable. You know, he goes out there and knocks the guard back. The quarterback stumbles and fumbles, and we got the ball back. The great thing is that's not the end of the story. Now we got to take it the distance and, and win the ball game. Oh my goodness! He stumbled and fumbled, and Billy Rowland recovered. Backfield will by Bartholomew, an extra pullback in as they send Bryson out to the wing of the left, and he comes in motion. Henry, to the right, stopped short of the goal line, stopped at the one-yard line. Tenoy Kennedy and Randy Garner made the tackle. It's a great effort by the Arkansas defense to keep Travis Henry out of the end zone. He breaks it outside here. Watch the white shirts try to keep him out. He's so strong. He just falls forward all the time. Arkansas elected not to use a timeout here. Bartholomew remains in the game. Bryson joins him in the backfield this time. Henry.
didn't feel the need to go to the air one time. They ran the ball five straight times and, and, and took the 28-24 lead. I actually, you know, was a little bit worried about the clock, you know, because we kept running during this whole thing and we were going to get down there and be short. But we got to give the defense all the credit because they created the opportunity for us. They knew they had Arkansas on the run. Philip Former told me he knew they had Arkansas on the run because they were, their defense was just stunned to be out there. And they just kept feeding the ball to Henry. And remember that remember that team had Jamal Lewis who got hurt, wasn't in that game. And they just kept feeding it to Henry and boom, 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 boom. They knock it in. I think it's six or seven plays, running plays in a row, and they knock it in. It was a great moment in, in Nealon Stadium history. Um, and not to have to throw a pass, not to, not to, 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 to basically take the clock completely down uh, to zero for them to make them use their, their timeouts. All those things that you that you want to do in a drive like that, we were we we, we did a great job of, of of maximizing our abilities at that particular time. We got it done. We got a chance to go on and play for the national championship. A lot of people point back to that uh, to that turnover by Billy Rattler. A flag on the play after the touchdown for unsportsmanlike conduct against Tennessee. It's a four point lead right now. For the volunteers with 28 seconds left. A touchdown drive after the Sterner fumble, five plays, 43 yards, all Travis Henry over 115 seconds. Well, he's been the workhorse this afternoon. What a great effort going up over the top, to sacrificing his body to get that ball into the end zone for Tennessee.